Stability is one of the biggest factors affecting safety within our industry and unfortunately it has led to several tragedies in recent years. We have made this video to help you assess and maintain stability on board your vessel. Be mindful of how your vessel is loaded when you are at sea. Is spare gear in the lowest part of the vessel and is catch stored on the deck or in the fish room? Try and ensure tanks are either completely full or completely empty. It is always a good idea to make sure fuel tanks are as full as possible before proceeding to sea. This will help give you a low centre of gravity. When fishing is good, it is easy to get carried away and to overload your vessel with catch. And unfortunately, this has been a main contributing factor to vessels capsizing in the last decade. Be sensitive to stability indicators on board your vessel, such as the roll period and your freeboard. Freeboard is a useful indicator of your vessel's loading capacity. Freeboard also goes hand in hand with the weathertight integrity of your deck. It is essential that down flooding points are protected on your vessel. This means that when hatches are not in use, they are secured weathertight. As a result of several fishing vessels capsizing in recent years, the MCA have now brought in minimum requirements for freeboard on all fishing vessels. Freeboard is just as an important factor as the centre of gravity on board your vessel. It is never a good idea to remove weight from low down your, on your boat in order to improve the freeboard. If you do want to improve freeboards, consider what weight could be removed from above the deck whether this is obsolete equipment or spare gear which is no longer in use. If your vessel has compartments or a space with water within it, be careful of what we call the free surface effect. Water freeing arrangements are critical for the safety and survivability of every fishing vessel. The next two videos show a vessel loaded in the same condition. In the first video, freeing ports are effectively dissipating water off the deck. However, in the second clip, water is being retained on the deck and the vessel's stability is rapidly becoming compromised. This is due to the free surface effect. To reduce the risk of free surface effects, ensure that water and fuel tanks are either completely full or completely empty. If this is not possible, consider the installation of baffles which will reduce the free surface effect. Stability is different on each person's boat. The MCA have published this handy guide which helps explain what stability means for you on board your vessel. There are also stability awareness courses available to the fishing industry.